Alright, so I'm making this video because I feel like there's no good trebuchet explanation videos on YouTube. So, I figured, uh, since I figured mine out, might as well make one to show everybody else. Alright, so let me start by saying that this trebuchet is it's about two feet long. I know there's a golf ball for uh, size. Um, so it's about two feet long, I think ten inches wide-ish. And so this is meant to shoot 30 feet. And I got a 10 pound weight on here for the counterweight. And I, like I said, it's used to shoot a golf ball. So one of the main things I was confused on while I was building mine was the whole sling and release. Okay. So we'll get down in here. As you can see, uh, this is my release, pretty much we're looking at right here, and my part of my sling. So, this, as this comes out, it's lifted, which allows a counterweight, counterweight to go down, this side to go up, and in regular, like, if I was actually doing it, this sling would fly up. Now as far as the pouch goes, as you can see, I just have a little um, little fabric piece like this. It's uh, stapled near the back corners, just so that it'll stay closed enough. But you also want it loose enough to the point where it can easily open as it's uh, being released so that the paint or the golf ball can be easily released. Okay, so now as far as the sling goes, I'm gonna want your sling. Maybe I would not uh, go past the axle, but you know you can uh, adjust your string length however much you need to uh, while you test um, to see how uh, much of an angle you need. Um, so we have one string. Right here. Actually, it should be up like this. So the bottom string is connected to this right here. Okay? So this is meant to come off and slide off as the arm moves. However, the top string is down and it's screwed in and tight on tight right there so that it does not come off. When it releases, so it's a little hard to demonstrate one-handed, but when that gets released, it's gonna come up. This hook is gonna come off. That's gonna open up. Okay. Now, as far as weight goes, like I said, I have a 10-pound weight on here, but you're really just gonna want to figure out what works for you and uh, take into consideration. How far you need to launch your object and stuff like that. Now the way I have this set up is I just have these little things right here holding it on so that it's adjustable so I can um, you know take it out and put on a different weight if needed and uh, so that makes it pretty simple. Right. And if you're wondering about this extra string right here, this is used to pull my release mechanism. And that's just because when I, um, for my project, I need to be standing a meter away from my trebuchet as it launches. So let me see if I can do it really quick. Yeah, there we go. Go ahead. So if you have a question about any of this, feel free to comment and um, I'll get back to you as soon as I can, even though I'm not a professional. I'm just a high school student doing my best in physics, but yeah, I'll uh, do my best to help you. So thanks for watching.